We back, baby. We back in here. Smoking yeah, sports podcast, you hear me? <laughs> Another beautiful week in sports. Yes, indeed, man. We're going to touch up on this local scene first. Yeah, we're going to touch up on the local scene first, man. Say no. Hold y'all here, brother. Y'all coming out two tough losses. John Curry is getting a business, huh? And you know, I still feel like St. Aug one of the best teams in the state. Keep y'all head up. I remember Carl opened up the season 0-3. Didn't lose another game, won the state title. This was three three years ago. It could be done. Keep y'all here. Y'all lost to two of the best teams in the state, man. Zachary and, 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 and you know, and John Curry, man. That's just going to build y'all, build, make y'all more of a beast. Like I said, I'm picking y'all to beat Brother Martin this week. I think they bounce back and beat the number two team, in, I mean, the number three team in the state. I'm going to show you. Damn, oh, schedule tough, bro. Huh? You play Zachary, followed by Curtis, and now you got Brother Martin, three of the top five programs in the, yeah, state. Shit, shit. In the state right now. You got Carl playing St. James this week, huh? Ooh, Preston. The best receiver in the in the country, I mean, no, on he ESPN. Not. No, he's not. The noodles top 100 we got. No, he's not. We got Aaron Anderson. No, he's not. Did they? they know what I'm telling you. Preston, great. Preston, you great. Just like what I like, brother. I'm just a fan. Just talking as a fan. Just talking as a fan, brother. I, I ain't seen. I don't remember seeing nothing like Aaron Anderson. I really don't, brother. To me, he looked like a speed at receiver. Yeah, that's something. The speed, I mean, he played receiver in college, but that's what he looked like. The highlight but know speed the, in know college. Really, know what really type of player he is? Well, fuck your head up. One of the niggas you are uh, one of your all-time favorite. Percy. Percy. Percy Harvin, brother. Percy Harvin. He that type. Right yeah. there. <laughs> I could play anything. You want me to go check a nigga? Yeah. <laughs> I might go do that. Go lock a nigga. You want me to go check the best wide receiver on the last play of the game? I might go do that. You want to put me in the backfield and hand it off to me five times straight? I might do that. Yeah, man. I definitely got to catch some <laughs> you want, the game. You know, <laughs> you want, like, returning these kicks and shit, like... Like, and th- this the first time that comparison even came to my head just now on the show. But that's my comparison with him now, right now. He person. Percy Hovind. He that's person. a hell of a comparison. He person Hovind, brother. He all world. Because Percy yeah. was all world. <laughs> you couldn't tell C nothing <laughs> about sure. Percy. For sure. He my like dog the best was nigga in the my, league. Yeah, my dog was catching the migraines. He 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 was Tyreek Hill before Tyreek Hill really or something. You heard me? Percy Harvin. Nigga yeah, forget what big, Percy yeah. Harvin did. At Florida and in the league. I think we forget about Percy in Harvin because his little he short his little thing. his little short little run. But man, on them teams with Adrian Peterson and with Brett Fall. Percy can't got him a ring too at the right quick with Seattle. Bitch ain't even play. Come back in the Super Bowl, run a kickback, Listen, all man. that. Woo, woo, woo. I'm going to keep it real. You know, you know we Saints fans. Coaching stopped them people from getting the ring. Them people got the with ball. With Minnesota? With Minnesota. Oh, them yeah. people got Adrian Peterson in his prime before he got hurt. With the fucking ball on the same side of the field and Brett Fall through the pick. No, that's they, after he got hurt for sure. That's after Adrian got hurt. Oh, no, this the same season. He come back and rushed for the two stacks when he got hurt. It was that year. I ain't sure that was about the year that. he come out the injury. Yeah, it was. They almost went to the fucking bowl. Like really, they was the best team in the league no, that year. Man, really, I don't, I don't think Brett Favre was there when he rushed for the two racks. Right? Yeah, right. Brett Maybe Favre was there when he, he rushed for the two racks. Brett Favre was the quarterback. They just had got Brett Favre. He coming off injury. The nigga thought thinking they wasn't gonna run it, and <laughs> they lit this bitch up. The Saints had to hit the fifty nine yard. Like I said. They had they keep handing that fucking ball off to Adrian Peterson. I was scared to death, brother. We was dead. He was killing us too. But they wanted Father to be the hero. They'd have fed that fucking beast. We'd have lost. And they was gonna win the bowl. They was gonna fuck the coats up with Jared Allen and them and shit. They was ready for Peyton Man and them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they was ready, you know what I'm saying? So And them bitches come back and be us with that stupid ass play. 
Yeah, Aaron Anderson. Kirk Cousins and uh, I'm giving him the Percy Harvin. He get my Percy Harvin comparison. Yeah, man, that's that's big, that's big uh, comparison, bro. That's like one of the best to do it, Percy Harvin. But now this kid Preston, he got all the accolades, bro. I ain't taking nothing from him. Oh, he he's deserving of that number one ranking he got. Bad. I just like yeah. I haven't saw Preston though, so Preston I, bad, nah. He play all over the field, play everything, check a nigga, do all that. Yeah, he he the real deal. Go out that Friday, brother. That's all I can tell you. Judge it for yourself. I just like Evan Anderson. Preston ain't ranked number one for nothing. Yeah. ESPN three hundred. He ain't ranked number one. He ranked number one overall. I wish I could. I wish I could uh, make that game, man. That game get a stream. I'm gonna send you the link. Yeah, yeah, I'll be on the road. I'm better. That game Fuck getting streamed, bro. Uh, who else? I, who else? I seen. Uh, look, I haven't seen Brother Martin yet. You yeah, know, you know we just getting going. We I, still, we still. I saw getting a few together. highlights. I know they got a real good quarterback, and I know they have like the best tight end in the state. It's supposed to be going somewhat. This big old guy, tight end. You know, and you know, you always have to respect Brother Martin. I just feel like saying, no, I'm not about to lose three weeks in a row. They're just too good. They're too good and well coached to lose three weeks in a row. Yeah, and I think they banged up and shit, too. So hopefully they're probably healthy this week coming up. But, um, yeah, I ain't, I ain't really hit too much about no other games. I'm not sure if everybody really playing just yet. Everybody back now. Everybody back now. Everybody playing, uh, Landry and Carver play. You know, Carver coming off a good win. They beat McDonald 35 last week. 19 nothing. Yeah, 35. But Carver rebuilding. 35 went down to 3 at in Booker T District. They ain't got nothing. Yeah, they ain't got no seniors and nothing over there. Mm -hmm. But uh, that's what's up, dude, man. We got uh, we got the big game with Carl St. James this week. I ain't sure what other big games they really got local wise. That's a big game. Car the big game in the city is next Saturday, October 9th. Car in East. Car in East and next Saturday. Next Saturday. So Yeah, that's the, you know. That's the one. Circle that. We're going to move on to the Thursday night football, bro. We just, Jacksonville, Cincinnati, man. They just finished up. Joe Burrow done pulled that thing out, man. You Trevor know. look good, though. Trevor look all right. Trevor look all right. But, you know, Joe Burrow got. Beef, you know, Urban Meyer on that sideline, man. Right. Yeah, and I couldn't touch the field with you, homie. You know what I'm saying? Right. I couldn't touch the field with you, big dog. I had to get up out of there. Right, they get up out of there. Ooh. Every time I see you, good one, see. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to touch you. Good you one, see. Me? Why you ain't never tell me that? I, I, yeah, I mean, I, you ain't never make me realize that. I had to realize it from earlier. Watching, watching TV right. and shit. You chose JT Barrett and them over me. Yeah, you chose JT Barrett. You chose, um, <laughs> I forgot that account. Your boy who won the championship was Zeke Elliott. Uh, he was dead in. Barrow was, was dead Jones? in. Jones. Jones. Yeah. You feel me? But you got the number one pick right here. Going against you tonight. <laughs> 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 you ain't want to play me, but look here. And he and made Oaks. a game winning drive, and everything. Oaks. That's why I see. 350 yards or so. Urban Meyer, this is not college. You up 14 nothing on the one yard line, about to go to halftime. Y'all go for it. Trevor Lawrence, take a sack. Y'all lose the game by the same three y'all didn't take. Could have went up 17 nothing. That's what the people said on Sports Center tonight. Why, why teams up? don't want to go up 17 nothing? They want to be dogs and go up 21 nothing. Uh, so what? We at the one yard line. We about to come kick this chip shot field goal and go up by three possessions in the NFL. Oh, he was at the one, though. That was at the I, one. I, I, I was in front of the TV. That was at the Damn one or it. two. That was at the one or two. That's Close. tough, at the one. It's tough, lying. though, but, like, with a minute left to go in the half and all that, you got to kick that ball, brother. And when you're on two, when you're on two, you kick, you got to kick the ball. I mean, you gotta go when you're on two, why wouldn't you go for it? When you're on two, I mean, when you're on three. You, you're on a one. You're when on you're, a one. When that's you're on three, they on three. Not they, three. not they on and four when they lost tonight. When you on and three, brother, you go up seventeen nothing. You we got to win the game. Fuck. 
You're on the one <laughs> to yeah. go up 21 nothing, and you already have 14 nothing. That's tough. I might want to go up 21 nothing if I got the chance. The, it cost you the game. I mean, I can say it cost you the game. You left points on the board. Yeah, the but points you lost by. That's like saying you're going for it on four down at another spot. The percentage is you should go for it. No, but that's different than when you left points. Going for a first down and leaving points. You, got, you see what I'm saying? You know, yeah, we at the fucking 47. We ain't got Justin Tucker. We can't kick this bitch from here. So going for it might be the right thing to do is forward one. But if we could get these points <laughs> from a seven yard, from an eleven yard field goal, brother. It what I'm saying. They score, they win a game. That too. That oh, was oh, tough. We know it's tough. But we it wasn't school, it wasn't the right thing to do. Though. For y'all to beat us, have, you know, yeah. them 24 second half points. It's a little tough. We only had to get in the end zone once, you know, or something in the second half. All the momentum switch. When people come back and beat you, tie the game, 14-14 after that. We're going to switch if you was going 14 in the third quarter. <laughs> come out, let's go quick. <laughs> Tight ends go back to back. Boom, boom. Like in the at the line with Tebow. Hut run behind the line. Fuck no. And Joe that's Burrow the play they Buck. called. They called the Hut quarterback <laughs> keeper. Man, nigga blew that shit up. <laughs> yeah, man, nigga blew that shit up. Why, you gonna see? Nigga blew that shit up. Joe Burrow, bro. Three and one. Ain't even fully recovered yet, man. Can he win the division? Yeah, he can win that bitch. You know, Cleveland over that sit night. With that fucking defense, brother. <laughs> man, you see this man, Miles Garrett? <laughs> man. Fucking right, he can win a division. Just to that. But we going to go over a little bit of the other um, last week. Saints. What we saw. Saints did their thing, man. I was at the game, bro. New England, bro. Beautiful stadium. I'm going to tell you, though, see, I feel like... ID, top notch. John Payton, sometimes his fucking head so big and swole, he be too smart for his own good. I feel like we be leaving points out there sometimes, some weeks. We played a good game Sunday. What we We, did? We did play a good game, brother. But it was like... I don't know. We did the right thing. Football, boy. I'm saying that we could have really whooped the fuck out these people and scored 30 or something. It just seemed like we just... Manage the game, play clock management. Yeah, man, man, man still trying to figure out James, Winston, James Weston. Right. You can't think we just could throw it around. I feel like we could do what we did in week one a little bit more with the 35, 38 points. And, you yeah. got to think about the points, though. James didn't throw the ball for. He completed what? He was 14 for 20. I don't even know if he had 100 yards. I think he, what he had, 100 he had or something like 182 yards? 182 yards It wasn't so, even that much. It definitely wasn't more than 150. Fold, something yeah. like that, yeah. He had the five touchdown, but there was after some good ball playing, some good defense, some good running the ball, some Turn good shot picks, turnovers. You know, it was a team effort. Sean knew I what he was doing. I feel like we could have scored more points on New England, but I guess we ain't have to. New England got a D. They got a D. The people was locking that shit up. Us running the ball got us to win that game. Alvin Kamara toting that rock, you know. In defense, we got a we got a tip punt, got us good field position. We got a pick six. We was locking that shit up. Mac Jones ain't really get going to that second half. So you know, our offense got to get better though. You know, our offense got to get better. Kamara. Kamara told that bitch, dog. <laughs> Kamara, bro. Kamara, he told that bitch. AK. The stats ain't showing. He ain't going off yet, but he getting in the end zone. He running hard. Kamara ready, man. We got an AK-41. We got an AK-41. You feel hey, don't me? call this chopper city for nothing. We got a chopper in that backfield. You know? We got a cutter in that backfield. So we, 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 went up there, we went up there to New England, did our thing. 
Tampa went up to L.A., got their ass bust. Got their ass bust. You did. Matthew Stafford, them came to their thing. <laughs> got their ass bust. You did. Yeah. You know, um... Carolina looking good, oh, bro. Speaking of the Saints, before we get on the, to the NFL, what's going on with Mike? What's going on with Michael Thomas? I ain't yeah, really been checking right, right. I mean, you know, you supposed no, to be out five, six. No, they just took him something. That's what I wanted to ask. He might they be off IR. Yeah, they just, he was at the game looking good. All right, because they just took him off something. I saw him right there. Like, I mean, he walking around like tripping. he ain't got no problem with us, so he must be, you know, healing up. If I ain't tripping, see, they took him off IR, and now he on the pup list. See, IR changed now this year. IR only mean you got to sit out three games instead of six. So niggas going to be going on IR. It's only three games. Now. Oh, so it used to be six. So that, that's it used why to be they, six games. You going IR, gonna you like, fuck. They going to try their hardest not to put you on IR. Bro. The old The old, one, right? yeah, because that means you gone for six weeks for sure. Yeah. IR, now nah, it's three weeks. Oh, so that's why he off now. This week, four. Now yeah, you could take him off. I mean, it don't. You could be three but weeks he ain't or more. Sunday, huh? I don't think he's playing. I don't think he's playing. Nah, it'll be surprising to be like, all right, Michael Thompson was practicing. Oh, all right, all right. In yeah. drills and warm ups. But I think we'll there. hear something about Michael. Michael Thomas started. He's been cleared to do drills or Cause whatever. Because I think I heard he was projected to come back in between week five. To seven? Yeah, that's cool. Fuck, it's about this week four. This week four right here. Because Cincinnati, three and one after they won the night. So this this week four right here. This is two more weeks. That's going to help Winston out for sure. Right. I think we can have him back for the Tampa game. Tampa, Tampa go to New England this week. And get what? Now that we own to that, noodles upset alert. This week, the fucking uh, he gonna put he he the all right. Nick, if Nick Saban do it in college, he gonna do this shit in the NFL. The fucking teacher gonna beat the student. I'm picking it right now. New England gonna beat Tampa Sunday. There Upset. You go. Upset alert. Upset alert. New England and New England got time coming back. New England and New England. Everybody thinking he about to go out there and fuck them people up. Y'all still forgetting New England got a defense. And brother. <laughs> you hear me? And Tampa don't. That what everybody not saying. Everybody looking at bread and woo 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 man. That speak the fucking real. Them people don't got no defense, brother. I don't know, though. They got pass rushers that's it's coming. That's the thing. That's that, why I don't know if, 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 it, if the Patriots could beat them. The line only seven. Now, it's in New England. I can understand why the line seven. But the Saints just went beat them by 20 out there. So, why the line seven? Beat them by 15. Oh, yeah. whatever. The Saints just went dominated them out there. Yeah, Saints got now a better D than Brady. Tampa. Exactly. Saints got a better D than Tampa. <laughs> but... Tampa D ain't just no pushover. Tampa don't have a second. Devin team. White, no. So anybody could come through it on them. Anybody can come through it on them. This game depends on Mac Jones if he going to be able to. If they can protect him. If he going to be able to put up 20-plus points. You got to expect time to get 20. Yep, nigga scoring 20 on Tampa. So Mac could get around 20, 28 points, 20 to 28 points. They'll have a chance. I think the Patriots could slow him down. They got a great secondary. Um, what they got? Jalen Mills. Jalen Mills. What they got from LSU? Somebody over there. One of them, Mills. Something. Mills in Philly or one of them. Hold on. Damn. No. They got a safety from. No, they got yeah. They got Jalen Mills now. New England got Jalen Mills. Jalen Mills. Now. All right. But you know they got Gilmore now. Got Gilmore. Yeah, they got Gilmore. Stephen <laughs> Gilmore. I'm mean, not not yeah. even thinking. With the McCarty boy. <laughs> In the back. They secondary top notch. With stars on their line. Plus they got Bill Belichick, man. <laughs> and who else know time? Who the fuck else know? And look, Mina, I ain't not I think I'm calling the upset, <coughs> but the points are locked. The points are locked. New England. That's with what the I'm seven. talking about with, with the bet for us when I say they are locked. Now I ain't stupid. <coughs> I'm not going to put my money on them to win, but I think they can. 
They my that's my upset pick. I think New England gonna beat them, but betting the points. Bill Belichick with seven at home, ain't never a bad bet. I don't care who's starting from. Mm -hmm. Matt Castle, it don't even matter. You know, New England at home with seven. Shit, Chad. They met a they met a tough matchup with the Saints this week. In New England. ID was top. They couldn't do nothing. We we got the best D in the league. Our line dominated. Because we from top to bottom good. Lattimore, you you're not throwing this way. We picked them off three times. And yeah, we, we got smacking all these shit. Veteran cornerbacks. We got Robit and all them dudes good, man. <laughs> we gonna be slick side dangerous. Like I said, we could go through some little shit early on. But once our offense go to clicking and Michael Thomas back and Jameis Winston in the groove, looking at it, ID bro. gonna be good. We gonna be tough I to deal with. I think we the only team in the NFC that could really beat the Rams. We got the D to match up with them, and Sean Payton. And Sean draw Payton up. could help. You know, could fuck with y'all defense. You know, he could help. <laughs> Sean he gonna Payton, draw he something up to gonna, help yeah. slow down Aaron Donald and them. One thing I noticed about the Saints, and you can go back in Sean Payton run, we always was good against the best defenses. The Baltimore's, all that. When Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, and them was in the league, all that. We was going up to the Baltimore, beating them and all that. When they got the number one D and all that Chicago in the league. Shit. We, we going to score 30 on you. You got the number one D in the league. You can't do the Super Dome, 33. Yeah, you allowed to score 40 on you. <laughs> don't. Well, we coming in your spot lighting this bitch up. Yeah. For sure. Yeah, so Sean Payton always do good against the great defenses. He do. He do. He do. We got Carolina this week. Good ass defense. Good defense. They, they got the best D in the league right now. Well, I thought we had the Giants this week. My bad. Yeah. My bad. Tampa got. Uh, I mean, Dallas got Carolina. Carolina. I'm going to Dallas. All right, we're going to go to that game. game next because that's a good game. Yeah, but we got the Giants we with got Daniel the Jones Giants, now. Which is, we can't even overlook these people because they got talent everywhere. This is the NFL. Game by game, we got to take yeah. it. Yeah, Saquon, <laughs> he looking like he ready to cut up. <laughs> exactly. He getting healthy and healthy, he, you know. We, I think we're going to be able to slow him down, though. And, um. Uh, I fuck with dude, man. Ever since he came out high school, let your bro peppers. Fuck with your bro. <laughs> I fuck with Michigan, dude. man. Nigga been on Michigan him. Michigan dude from NY. He spent a 16 for his uh, commitment and all that. Remember uh, when he came out, he was like a little, you know, high boy type of nigga type recruit. Flashy. Yeah. I'm fucking with him. I'm fucking with your bro peppers. I just like how he coming on and off the field. You know what I'm saying? And he a great year athlete. Punt return, kick return, everything. Still in the league. He like a hundred badger type of player, but, you know, not the accolades. Not saying he, you know, but that's the type of player he is. Fuck with the bill. <laughs> it could be a tough game if we let it. If we slow him down and be able to score the ball, we should be able to beat them by double digits. But, you know, woo de woo We got, um, you see, we go to Dallas, Carolina. Dallas plays. Hey man, Philly came in there building Dallas first home game. I I I knew it, but that was a man put everything on Dallas tonight. I knew that. Dag back. I think um I'm not sure if you said it, but didn't you say like Dak would be your MVP this year or something? I don't. I don't know if I said that on the show. I Not probably, on the show. I probably ran Me it with you. you. Dak, yeah, Dak could win you MVP like for Dak sure. You like Dak could win MVP. Yeah, yeah. You always try to remind us who he was on the pace to throw for six thousand, whatever the fuck he's about to throw for. <clears throat> Man, and I always remind him. You know, I've been fucking with Dak since Mississippi State. Ain't no fucking way that dude just was winning games woo, at LSU, beating Alabama, throwing this bitch yeah. around. I knew he was good. Ben knew he was good, and I'm not going to doubt Dak. Dak. Dak will play. Fuck all that Cowboys, janky shit and all that. Dak going to play. That Cowboys going to be right there. They could beat the Rams. Am I like it? What Mike McCarthy doing with them? Well, they not, they, 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 they easing off of Ezekiel. Zeke ain't touching it like he used to, but I understand why. Hold up, hold up see. You know what I'm saying? 
We got with pulled the Mike it. McCarthy. Huh? Guess what? What? It ain't Mike McCarthy. Who it is? It's that fucking boy. It's Kellen Moore. And that's what I like about Mike McCarthy. He not stuck in his way. He's something like Bruce Arians and he got out the way, brother. I'm glad you he, say that. He letting this boy. It's definitely Kellen Moore. It's Kellen Moore, brother. It's definitely Kellen Moore Mike because. Mike McCarthy took a back seat. Now, he, he, he telling them like, basically, you know, in certain situations, now we going to run a pass play right here. Kellen Moe going to draw it up, I feel like. But, like, situation where we going to run it right here, I feel like McCarthy going to call all that. But who offense this is? This that boy Kellen Moe offense. And Kellen Moe was there before <laughs> McCarthy. He brought him on. Like, you my offensive coordinator. When he got hired, he I like, think that was Jerry Jones. No, man. The, the, I don't give a fuck how Jerry Jones feel. If you the head coach, see, you don't want to hear that if you don't want him. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like, no, no, Jerry Jones. McCartney really come in the door saying, no, saying he want Kellen Moore. No, but I thought Kellen Moore was there before he Mike was. McCarthy. He was. He come in the door like he's still my OC. When they come out at him, like, look, yeah. I still want Kellen Moore as I my OC. It. I would think that was even said before he, that wasn't even his decision. If it was no, like if it that. wasn't his decision, he would have just got the head coaching job like they did Jason Garrett. They ain't, they feel like he ain't ready for that head coaching job yet, brother. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They wasn't Jerry hired Jones McCarthy. wasn't getting rid McCarthy of Kellen Moore. It's just schooling him to become the coach. He gonna be Dallas coach. Yeah, but fuck that's what's McCarthy about to don't wanna hear that. That no, I'm schooling right, him to be the coach. Fuck no. But this his offense. I can I can feel like this is no. offense. I think that's Jerry Jones' move though. Jerry Jones is like Kellen Moore not going nowhere. I'm a hire head coach, but Kellen Moore not going nowhere. Whoever the head coach is, he's about to be. The offensive coordinator or whatever we going consultant, whatever he's ball, you know, he gonna be the offensive he's coordinator. He's drawing these plays up, partner. For sure. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So that's why I said, I'm, you, and you never know, Jerry. Jerry might not be able to keep him playing around. You didn't give McCarthy the job, <laughs> and now to look at the Bears, you get that boy to Justin Fields. <laughs> <laughs> Get Kellen Moore to the nah, Bears with out. that defense. J- Joe Brady. That too. Carolina keep winning. <laughs> and do their thing with Sam Don- Sam Donald. Oh, Sam Donald. I've been Sam told good. he was cold. Now, now, I'm a Sam too. Donald fan. I've been told a nigga he was cold. Thank. Cold and since Sam USC. Donald, he went to the Jets, bro. Yeah. Sam Donald went to Cleveland like Baker Mayfield. They probably would want to won a bowl by now. <laughs> so, yeah, he cold like that. So he could throw the ball. But Carolina going to be tough to deal with. I don't see him winning this week. I don't know. No Christian McCaffrey. McCaffrey. But that backup, Chubbard from Oklahoma State. Cold. Cold-blooded. He, like, <laughs> he ain't McCaffrey, but all right. They got trumpet back there. I, I think about. this is going to be a tough game, Dallas, Carolina. It is. The line only four and a half in what Dallas. Game, oh, right. It's in Dallas. And Dallas. Carolina 3 and 0, oh. Dallas 2 and 1. Carolina really might have the best D in the league right now, though. Them and uh, Dante Rams. Jackson, bro. Nigga ain't catching nothing on Dante Jackson. I run the 4 2. Ain't nothing over the top. So what 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 they scored? We scored seven on them. Somebody scored six on them, and I think somebody scored fourteen or something on them. They threw first three games or something. They gonna be tough to beat. They damn near like the Rams. I think I can't even think of them people on the line, but I know they line good too. They got damn near the best linebackers and shit, dudes who smart as a motherfucker, man. They cool. With a secondary. They cool. Gonna be a tough game. I think Dak is a tad bit better than and they Sam wide Darnold. receivers. Cole Moore and your boy the deep threat. <laughs> they got Robbie Anderson, Robbie Anderson from the Jets that's with Sam Darnold. Him and Moe. They tough. They damn near like the Rams, bro. That's they Deshaun Jackson. He really like that. Yeah, right. Robbie Anderson. He's fast as a <laughs> and motherfucker. Moe is like they Cooper Cup. <coughs> yeah. Cole. So they gonna be tough down the line, Christian McCaffrey. Our division really gonna be tough again. Speaking bro. of the Rams, though. I mean, they can lose this week. Play Arizona. They play Arizona. This the, yeah, this the one going to show you. This was going to see what's up. Y'all got that D, but you got the kryptonite oh, oh, you with the Kyler Murray. You got a nigga, you got a line like yours. 
They got Chandler Jones. He got the most sacks in the league the last seven years. Donald don't got more sacks than him. Chandler Jones. And then you give him J.J. Watt. Yeah, <laughs> you know, so yeah, they coming, staff. Now, McVeigh, what you gonna? You got to drop these protections and shit. But guess what, dude? <laughs> this I watched this this morning. On the average, since McVeigh been the Rams head coach, he done beat these people by twenty points a game on the average. Arizona Kingsbury ain't beat the Rams yet, and they lose to him by twenty on the average. So the Rams basically been beating the piss out of them every yeah. time they play them. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah, they're going to do it again. The Rams, they kryptonite. I don't think so. I don't think so. I think this the year it's going to be a good game at least, for sure. For right, sure, for right, sure. Right, 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 right. D-Hop, A.J. For Green, sure, man. Kyler Murray, he not turning that ball over that like that like he was. You know, he's special, but... He was still making a few little mistakes. Not even calm that down a little bit. It's gonna be hard, dude. That dude can run. He can run his ass. He can run, bro. He can run his ass. When we go back down to just outside playing touch football or something, yeah, you might be cold. Uh -uh, Let me hit you with something. (laughs) Hey, right. You see what Lamar doing? He's doing it again. Lamar, bro. He converted on a Ford and what, 19 for Justin Tucker to hit that 66 yard field goal, bro. They play somebody. They play, who they play this week? Baltimore. Um, I man, felt man, like they could be so. on upset alert. I felt like they could be on upset alert, bro. It's always tough to beat these fucking running quarterbacks, bro. I oh, yes, it like that, yeah, It's just tough. Bro. Oh, yeah. I got them losing this week. Who they play? Tough. Von Miller and them coming. Denver. Yeah, Denver. You know That's why? not even an upset. And, 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 and Denver, Denver probably the it's favorite. It's a public upset. In the football Denver world, three and it ain't no upset. But in the public, man, Denver who? I'm going with Lamar. You know? I feel <laughs> That's you. all around the world. Denver who? Boy. Yeah, but Denver <laughs> three and no. I know. That's what I'm trying to tell you. But Denver going to beat these people. Dem- no, these people just beat Kansas City. And who else they beat? Lamar just look good. But you come to Denver, and Denver the favorite. I like Denver Sunday. That's going to be a tough game. I like I Denver Sunday. I can see Denver beating the people. I can see Denver beating them at home in a close man. game. At home, Teddy not going to give you the ball. Man, Teddy is a dog. <laughs> Teddy, Teddy not going to turn dog. it over, brother. That's another one. Let Denver keep winning. Teddy going to be in the MVP racing, man. Get Teddy, man. Get Teddy some fucking awards, man. Some credit. Yeah, man. Fuck that, man. Teddy be doing his fucking thing. <laughs> Straight up. Yeah, Teddy be doing his thing, bro. He be doing his thing, man. You know? We be talking and about I, potential and, I, and, and, shit. I, and, I, and I don't like to get on, get on the racial shit, brother. But if this man was the other color, brother, <sighs> ain't no way he'll be getting these, this treatment. With the production he what he give, it's like nobody really talk about how Minnesota fucked over him. Listen, brother, they could have went to the fucking Super Bowl that year. Teddy Bridgewater drawing them down there, and back to the two thousand yard year. This the two thousand yard year. What in that year with the Super Bowl? Yeah, yeah, it's this year when Teddy Bridgewater drove down there and they kicked the field goal. And the nigga missed it. He went wide left. Teddy Bridgewater come get hurt back the next year, dog. Minnesota really was supposed to stick with Teddy, brother. I ain't lying, dog. And if Teddy was white, they would have stuck with him. Real talk, brother. If Teddy was a white boy, he would still be in Minnesota. And that's how cool the game is, brother. Yeah, yeah hey, brother. Sh- Think about it, dog. Yeah. Come on, man. Andrew Lucknum had to shoulder had to go out first for them people. Like, man, go ahead on to retire. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, we didn't watch. You know, motherfuckers get hurt and shit. Minnesota fucked over to Bridgewater. The Vikings, brother. They fucked over. They ain't, like, what no reason to get rid of that? He been in a crazy situation. He's <laughs> supposed to be our quarterback. <laughs> Drew too. Brees waiting one more year, like. That dude, need, it was time for him to get paid, man. He's supposed to go get his money. Carolina, he go get some money. They trade him. Oh, yeah, we think somebody else better than you. Right. Damn, my nigga. Your best Christian McCaffrey 
I think he was off and on hurt last year, but he was playing a little bit. Now this going it was all right. This going this going to tell me a little something about Elway. I want to see how Elway going to handle this. Elway, you play quarterback. I want to see how you handle it. I want to see how you handle it. You play the position. I want to see how he handled this with Bridgewater, though. Bridgewater got to beat them people quarterback at least the next three years. At least the next three years, they got to stick it out with Bridgewater. Who else you going to go get? Who you going to go get out the draft? Right now, going to come out, going to be better than them. You know? Who going on the market in the league you going to trade for? I'm just saying. That defense, go get this man some weapons. He didn't prove to you he don't turn the ball over. Just keep making that defense stout, and you can win the bowl with Bridgewater. Keep tuning that defense up, and you can win the bowl with What's him. What's up, Webbers and Ronald? <laughs> right. Camaro was going off with him. It was going clean off. Teddy a star quarterback, man. Niggas ain't better than Teddy, man. Real tough. We got, we got, who else we got out there, man? College. College, we got to give our picks first. Let's give our picks then. Oh, miss. You no, know I'm talking about for NFL. Oh, man. NFL? NFL. NFL, you can't keep going. <laughs> you got to, yeah, you got to be thinking about some other. You keep, out of bound, can't keep going because out of bound. No, man, why you keep saying time. that? Because you made me give away my, I couldn't give my lock, bro. No. Don't I'm do saying, me that, brother. That's all Listen. I'm saying. Why we got to be going against and, Alabama? You know, why I want, be I the want picks, to take it huh? to y'all. I want to take it to our audience, brother. Listen, like I told C, you can't look at no line or nothing with Alabama, bro. Like, it's like they Bama. They didn't whip so much fucking ass in the college, brother. No matter who they playing or whatever, it's like I yeah. got Alabama. I'm gonna go against this them. It's I'm like saying, I'm, 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 I'm gonna go with I'm them. Saying, Alabama can't why lose you, in nobody's eyes until they lose. All right. Well, why you gotta mess with that game? Why I gotta mess with it? Cause I think Ole Miss better than them. They got a true freshman quarterback. They defense. But you they, just gave a perfect example. They're vulnerable. On brother. why? You know, I feel like a better pick could be made against instead of fucking with High the Bama game. better pick could be made when the Heisman Trophy winner about to play against Alabama. He getting 14 <clears throat> points. That's the lock pick. You getting two touchdowns with a nigga that's going to score 40. Lock. You getting two touchdowns with the other. With the, that's just like that year when Texas A&M had Mike Evans. Nigga told me they was dumb. They had Mike Evans. Oh, go ahead. Listen. Preach. Yeah, let Old me Miss. preach. Six years ago, uh, seven years ago, the same thing was here. Me and CD, I'm telling him I'm about to take this nigga named Johnny Football. He like you out your fucking mind. (laughs) You heard me? (laughs) Alabama about to beat the fuck out this this, this boy. He he, he ain't going to beat Alabama. He cold. Beat him, getting 14. But like I said, there was Alabama. Julio, them just left. uh, All this here. You know, they got Mark Ingram, them, all this. You know, ain't nobody thinking they're going to, you know, but they seeing what Johnny Football going to do. They know in Alabama, you know, favorite in this game should win. But, man, you know, if you really know football, some of them lines, dog, that just, that, that, that shit, some of that shit be easy money. This the line I'm be saying. out there for perception sometimes. With the them best, 14, bro. that's just because Alabama. They could give 14 to the greatest team in college history. We could go get them. We could go get the 2002 Ed Reed in the Miami. They're going to say Bama by 10. Fuck no. <laughs> I feel you, but fuck You know, you get what the fuck I'm saying. Fuck no. I know they ain't going to say team. But you know what the fuck I'm Miami saying. Miami going to be, that's probably the best college team ever. So they're going to be favored. <laughs> but it's all I'm saying <laughs> with betting. I want a, I want a lot to be. That's a lot. Listen, no, listen. I want a lot to be. You ain't had to sweat. You ain't had to. Uh, uh, uh. You playing Bama, son. You know you got to sweat. Ain't no, ain't no sweating with this nigga Matt Carell. Man, come on, man. Ain't no sweating with him. I ain't you sweating going with against Johnny. Bama? I ain't sweating with Johnny Football. You ain't never comfortable. That's all I'm saying. This dude colder than Johnny Football. Even the Florida game, Bama was up by like 10, 12. You felt <laughs> like, well, hold up, now these bitches can still cover <laughs> for sure. Now Florida still lost by two right. and covered, okay. and he liked it. Florida. I'm just saying. To me, that's not locks. To me, a lock is. 
when you go ahead and pick Eastern Michigan or something and they win by 50, giving 17. You know, uh, uh, picking Bama when they give it 14 and win by 35. You know, going against Bama. To, I, I'm just talking about Bama, really. Why are we going against Bama talking about their locks? Fuck no, I ain't gonna never feel like a lock is against Bama. <laughs> Joe you Burrow, not, that was your lock against yeah, Bama. Joe Burrow because that that was a once in a whatever team they playing against. You don't see what these people doing, Ole Miss? How this dude throwing this ball? Or no? Man, it's we three games in. People doing this since last year. Last year. Yeah, they ain't believe nothing because I ain't hear nothing like that. Wow. It's Bama. If it, if there was ten and zero playing Bama. And Bama was 10 and 0, yeah, I know a little bit more about them. Mm-hmm. You feel me? And we'll have to pick it. It's a game. That's a prime time. Why well, I don't know when they're playing, but that's a good game. Pick a game that's going to be nice and wooty woo. And you know, we ain't going to pick everyone right, but a lot going against Bama. That's the second. Come on, we ain't just going to be All going right. against Bama. I got, them locks. Good, I got a good, I got a good, nice pick. And it's going to be a tough one to and pick. we got to give NFL. NFL, that's what I'm talking about. got to go NFL. It's, I got a good, tough, nice pick. Cleveland. They playing Minnesota at Minnesota. They giving Minnesota two. And I feel like now Cleveland got to start winning these big games. It's time now. Ain't no, you know what I'm saying? You got to start winning these games like this here if you want to go 12-4 and four and shit. You know, you got to start, yeah. Hey, you got to start opening up 7-0. and oh. What Cleveland there? 3 they lost to KC, 3-1. and one. Yeah, Two and one. Two and one. <clears throat> I got Cleveland. You got Cleveland as, your, as a pick. Cleveland is one of my picks. Cleveland plus two. I mean, Cleveland minus two. Mm-hmm. All right, all right. You know me, bro. I like, I like, I like picking with, with game plans and shit. So, I'm going to give you an under first. <laughs> I've, been, I've been picking these unders, but like, right. you know, but, and I done picked these people in the under before. I got the under in the Saints game. Under in the Saints against the Giants. They opened up at 47. The bitch had 41 and a half now. That's drastic change, you know. In the Saints? In the Saints. So... I like the under 41. I feel like we're going to lock them up. At worst, it's a tough game. You know, 21-17, some shit like that. I like the under in the Saints game. I can't take a game under in the dome. We might go far. I feel you. <laughs> That's the only thing. First game know, back, yeah. 31-7. Man. Man, okay. <laughs> Slow out. 31-7. <laughs> 31-10, you feel me? And I got another one, bro. And, I, and, and I'm, I'm in with him, bro. I ain't covered with him in two years, KC. I'm in with him now for the rest of the year. I don't care what the spread is, whatever. I got KC. I ain't going to miss him when they win by 30. When Tyreek Hill catch 350 yard bombs and shit. I ain't gonna miss it. I ain't gonna miss it. No, I'm, in. I'm sick of I'm, bet with I'm, KC. I'm, I'm in with him, brother. I, I gotta take them now. Every week. KC feel like they ain't covered none last year. They didn't. The other year before. They ain't covered yet this year. <laughs> you know. I'm not even playing. I'm not fucking with KC games. I'm fucking with them. I you think know. that shit about to Only thing around. I like with they KC about to start games whooping is the ass. over. They about the to start overs. whooping ass, bro. I like the overs in all KC game, cause you know one thing, the bitch can score in a in a in a in a in a, in a jippy. <laughs> you feel me? But um, I got a couple more picks. I like the over in the Frisco game. Frisco playing um Seattle. Seattle. I, I like the over in the Frisco game. That's a division game. They usually could figure each other out. But I like Seattle. But I like the over. I like the over in that game, and I also like Dallas to cover the four and a half against Carolina in Dallas. No Christian McCaffrey. I feel like Dallas really gonna be a good a good team this year. I feel like they gonna they gonna do their thing. The offense gonna get better and better and better. It's gonna be gonna be hard to stop. Amari, C.D. Lamb, 
Um, your boy Pilot coming out of the backfield. Zeke. Dak throwing his thing, playing good. They deke a hole up in with Makai Parsons and um all these dudes who playing, Jalen Smith, all these they going off. They they making some big plays back there. That is gonna be tough Dallas too. That is gonna be fucking good. I said that before the That is gonna be good, bro. The offense is could be the best offense in the league. And they defense you know, they defense look like they been on break right now. They probably could be a good defense, man. What I like about Dallas, I I just see them as like they might have the best offense in the league. Not saying that the numbers that they put up, I'm talking about what they have on the field. Nothing in the league might be better than what they put on the field when they snap the ball. They 11 offensive player. I think Dallas might have the best offensive team on the field. Now, production and shit, that's another. But, no, they got C.D. Lamb and Cooper, brother. And that dude Gallup Cole, brother, with Zeke and with Dak. They got a complete offense. With a good O-line. With a top-of-the-line O-line that's healthy now. You know what I'm saying? Everybody healthy. Dak healthy. The old line healthy. Zeke healthy. You know. You know my uh, Cooper like could come be the best receiver in the league today. Not saying that he's the best receiver, now, but he could come have, you know, ten catches, 162 yards, four touch. You know he could come give you that, Cooper. Then you yes, got that indeed. bad. Then you got that bad boy. He just getting better and better every week. I love C D Lamb. Yes, indeed. <laughs> he getting better and better every week. C D Lamb. He's special. Him. Yeah. Run after the catch. Everything. <laughs> he coming like that. Yeah. He remind. He remind me of Dez Bryant a little bit. Even though he, but he ain't got the same speed. build. Yeah, yeah. You know he he probably look faster than Dez. But just the way he play like. Grabbing that bit, moving after the ball, he could make some moves. And she reminded me of Dallas Brown a little bit. A little I like bit. Dallas, bro. I like, I like Dallas. Dallas. That's my that's my couple picks, brother. Under the Saints, over in the Frisco, Seattle. I think they're gonna end up scoring that game. Both of them, both offenses, and um, Dallas gonna continue to looking good, playing a good um, defense in Carolina. I got another interesting game this week. I got you know, one pick for college, though, when we get that. What? What you, what, what's happening? This Pittsburgh Packers game. Now, <sighs> what's crazy? I'm leaning towards taking Pittsburgh with the points this week, bro. Against. In Green Bay. In Green Bay, they're getting six and a half, and they're talking about it's over with for Ben and woo, woo, woo. One thing, though, dog. Pittsburgh D could come hold you to 10 to D. Evan Rodgers. That, the one thing, they can respect, and Ben Rosselberger. Yeah, he getting old and he don't got it no more. But he not going to look like that every week, though. See? This a week-to-week thing. Fuck how he looked last week. He still Ben Rosenberger, though. He might play the D. And what if he play the D with this defense and throw it around there? And he going to be like, damn, man, ain't been no. Came through the D. That's why I say it, it just be kind of tricky with Pittsburgh. Like, I don't really like to bet with him or against him. Yeah, I fucks with Pittsburgh. You know what I'm saying? They got that D. Yeah, Joe Hayden, what them, thing. TJ Watt, them man. When the last time Pittsburgh missed the playoff? Huh. That's what I'm saying. You tell me. <laughs> That's what I'm I saying. Can't, I can't. I don't. I don't even be, remember. Pittsburgh be winning these type of games. So, <laughs> right ain't no, It's Pittsburgh, man. Now, well, Mike Tomlin, Pittsburgh man. wins these type of games. Yeah, They man. looking bad last week. Now they come and play Evan Rodgers and them. They going to win the big games when they matter. They always did. You know, now this might be a year where I think they line ain't as good as it usually is. This wow. might be a year it could fall off, though. Rookie I think it is. Ben ain't got no time back there. He getting no and he ain't and got no time. And your boy fresh out of college, he not no true okay. running game. Now she Harris. Yeah. He a dog. They ain't got no line, yeah. though. Right. They don't got nobody to block. That's what I'm That's what I'm hearing. That's what I heard, like, Ben back there running for his life. Let's see. You know, so I may play a part. Green Bay, they can go to Green Bay. That's their type of 
atmosphere, yeah. everything, you know. <laughs> they could go to Green Bay and win, bro. You know, Pittsburgh is like a Green Bay. They damn near the same. But to me, you know, everybody hyping this type of New England game of the week, but the game of the week is Baltimore-Denver, bro. That's the game. Man, of they week. got some good game. They got the Rams, Arizona. That could be game of the week, that too. That could, too. That's it. That's the one that could compete with Cleveland and Minnesota. They got that one. Yeah, hey, but damn, that Rams, Arizona, going to... Come on, man. Shit. But everybody want to see Tom back home <laughs> in New England. And, you know... See how that play out, you know. That's Sunday night. That's the last that's game. That's Sunday night. And the Monday night game, I'm tripping down. This could be game of the week. Chargers and Raiders. Hmm. Division. Both of them hot. I think Derek Carr leading the league and passing and some shit. Yeah, he got the Bulls passing, y'all. Yeah. He about, he about looking come like the next KC. pig man. Or something. Yeah, that's going to be a good one right there. I think with, with the in, uh, in L.A. In L.A. And I, I, I like the Raiders with the three. I like the Raiders. John Gruden, bro. I like John Gruden to go on the road and beat this rookie. Because guess what? Y'all better start beating him. Because <laughs> he about to beat up for 15 more years. Yeah, for yeah, so, real. You hear me, You hear me? You, you want to beat him, You got to deal with him and Mahomes. You better beat him right now while he ain't got his smarts together. So I think I think I think Gruden will be able to trick him a little. It's gonna be a good game, but I think Oakland get a few turnovers out of him and pull that game out. I think Oakland go on that road, more veteran quarterback, Derek Carr. I'ma go I'ma go with Oakland. Mm-hmm. I think Oakland win that game. Josh Jacobs maybe be back, I ain't see yet. Right. I think he missed last game. Ain't no fucking tight end, man. Dude looking like Kelsey and fucking um <laughs> Kittle. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, boy, wild. Wild, yes, Man, dude, the 93 speed on, man, man, tight end. Dude be lining up wide, and then, you know, I forever fuck with your boy, man. What dude there from Alabama? Rugs. <laughs> Rugs, 4-2. They got him listed as the second fastest player in football behind Tyreek. So, they got Tyreek. People be forgetting about Oakland. <laughs> Remember when uh, your boy called the All Out Blitz last year? <laughs> Our old defensive coordinator, Greg Williams, Greg Williams for the Jets, <laughs> got fired <laughs> for the press conference. <laughs> he called the All Out Blitz for the last play of the game, dog. <laughs> with Henry Ruggs out there, dog. Dude, he got his piece. Dude, the his car they were getting out that bitch. Yeah, <laughs> yeah let him, they let him out. <laughs> dog, dude had to smoke. Dude, to smoke the whole fucking team. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Like I said, they got they got Tyree over there. That's another thing Oakland got. A straight threat that you got to have somebody over the top. So they putting you in the defense already. Oakland coming with that. They something like a, a like KC because they got him. And they got Wilder, the tight end like they Kelsey. They got like a KC type setup over there. They got speed. All their wide receivers fast. He not the only one. He just super fast. But the rest <laughs> of them niggas fast, dude. <laughs> you know what I mean? They got nothing but speed. And, like, you know, he been on Jacobs. I like Jacobs. I feel like he ain't got that home run hitter, but he a cold, cold running back. He ain't got that speed speed, but he a cold running back. Like, cold. He do what he do. Hopefully he be back. But with or uh, without him, I like the Raiders. With or without Jacobs, whoever running back, they're going to put in committee, hand it off. It's going to be Derek Carr, them slinging iron. <laughs> Tennessee got the Jets, man. Lock. <laughs> man. Derrick Henry. Man, we already know what Derrick Henry. We already know what the boy going to do. Man, man, fuck, you already man. know what's popping. Two touchdowns at least. 17 games, he going to rush for 2,000 again. He might have 200 this game. For real. This might, he might go ahead and have 200 this game. But what if he fought, What if he rushed for 2,500 with the extra game? Yeah, you know. <laughs> 200 for sure against the Jets. He going to cut up. Oh, yeah. 
He's gonna cut up. For and your sure. boy already said he running for his life. That dude Zach Wilson really good. He running for his life though over there. Yeah, man. It's another ugly week for you. It's another ugly week for him. Shit, man. Julio now. You know what I'm saying? What your college pick was, bro? Man, I got one college pick, bro, and it's not my usual. Ah. It's not my usual because I usually give shit like this. But, man, them people giving Arkansas 18 points, bro, Georgia, bro. Don't do it, see. They, Don't they do both it, four see. and no, they bro. They came out, they look good. I got to go with my wa- man Joe them, bro. But did you watch these people, brother? You ain't watching them. No, bro. I only saw a little Boy, I only saw a good bit of Arkansas. <laughs> I saw a little bit of Georgia this year. 18. That's the thing be, about college with me, bro. I can't catch all the games <laughs> like that, brother. so you don't be up on Don't be no fool, brother. I mean, look. <laughs> don't be no I fool. I like giving the points when it's like that. Don't be no they fool. They both four and no and one of them 18. <laughs> Damn, yeah. But I would don't not be take no the 18, fool, right? Boy. I think they really underestimating them people, man. Them dudes got a D, man. Dudes got a D, and they offense can't be that bad. It really took off on them. It underestimated them last week. With um, Texas a and them, they underestimated them. They was underdogs at home or something. Yeah, they, they the people took, took off took 14, off. nothing, 21, nothing on the people, man. Some shit. Say, brother. <laughs> man, look. <laughs> I know one thing. Them people getting 18 points, I already know. Them coaches got all the ammunition to feed them children. Man, they children, bro. Oh, yeah, see. Like. When you look up, this Arkansas. <laughs> Georgia. Yeah, Georgia may have a little bit more talent than Arkansas. They getting a little bit more recruiting pride than Arkansas. But Arkansas got a good little squad. They got a good little squad. And Joe top notch. I think, you know, the safety. They got a few niggas who top notch over there. Mm-hmm. But um, like, come on, man. That's enough amity. We four and no. We feel like we like that. Them dudes not about to go lose by no three touchdowns, bro. Arkansas, that's my pick, man. I'm a you know. I got I got a couple picks for you in college, cause college you gotta give a couple. See, he already be looking at the college. College got a hundred games. I gotta give y'all a couple. You feel me? One one is North Carolina. They playing Duke. Matt Brown ain't about to play with Duke. Twenty points, easy. Duke. I like North Carolina. This Duke. Slinging it. Yeah, this Duke. They got dude about. who talk Peyton Man over there. Yeah, Sam. Sam. Yeah, that too. I mean the coach shit. Yeah, yeah, and Mac Brown. Mac from Brown, Texas. from Texas, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I got him. He ain't about to play with no um he ain't about to play with no Duke, man. It's Duke, man. Duke lost the two lost by twenty to F C S school or something, man. That's a lot. And I got an upset alert in college. This one another pick. I got Cincinnati going on the road and beat Notre Dame. When a nine power five school ever in a hundred years went to Notre Dame and favored, name me one. Name me a school outside the power five schools that ever went to Notre Dame and was favored. This is the University of Cincinnati. This ain't Ohio State. This ain't LSU. This ain't Auburn. So they, this ain't USC. They favorite? Cincinnati favorite. So how you taking the underdog? No. I'm upset. Because Notre Dame ranked number nine, and they ranked number, uh, I mean, Notre Dame ranked number seven. Anyway, it's a nine power five against Notre Dame. Notre right, Dame. ain't an upset, dude. Yeah, it's an upset. It's not an upset if they're the favorite. That's, that's what makes it an upset. Yeah, technically. Yeah, technically. So technically, it's I feel not an you upset. though. You saying but it's a small this foot, school in this football world? A small school beating a big school. It's an upset. Yeah. But nah, I ain't. I don't think like that. I feel if they good, they good. Right. They, they favorite. They favorite. Ain't no yeah. upset. Cincinnati is favorite at Notre Dame, and they're gonna beat Notre Dame. They're gonna beat them. They getting them one and a half. You know the spot, but still, anytime Notre Dame not giving Cincinnati points in their home, lock. Cincinnati gonna beat Notre Dame. That's a good one. I like that. Bet. That's a good solid pick. Yeah, because what the fuck they doing? Cincinnati got this Notre quarterback Dame. Ritter. Oh, what that his name? Right. Huh? Yeah, Ritter. 
They got a quarterback name, last name, Ritter. Check him out. That's one of them. Cincinnati. Now, hold up. Now, I didn't check to see if that game was on the neutral site. Hmm. That's another thing. Right. Where is that game? Yeah, that might be uh, a type of player. Yeah, D. Rudder. That's his name. Oh, no, it's in Notre Dame, brother. The people favorite in Notre Dame. That's big, dog. That's big. I don't remember ever a small school going into Notre Dame favor. That's big. Like, that's telling me Notre Dame going to lose this game. You know? That's a good pick in the afternoon tomorrow. I mean, Saturday. Well, who? Don't you dang on what you say? Against Cincinnati? Nah. Right. It's like, this a lock. I'm going to go ahead and take Cincinnati. And then they're going to fuck around and lose by three. It's by three or something, huh? Tease it, though. You can tease it and take them with the seven. Mm-hmm. Tease it and take them with the seven. Mm-hmm. I like Central Florida to beat the sleeves off Navy. It's Navy down here, Navy shits. Navy shits, go against them. Shit trap, man. I think. Uh, what you think about home team? LSU Auburn. I like us. I really think we better than what people giving us because we lost that first game to UCLA. I feel like that just go to show you, dog, just how college football do you. If LSU don't lose that game right now, we four and no five and no. You know we top five in the country right now, right? We'll be ranked like number six in the country right now if we don't lose that game to UCLA. We'll be number seven or something right mm-hmm. now. All we got to do is keep winning. Our yeah. schedule is, you know, it's always you can't never better to lose out. early. Yeah, you can't never count us out. Yeah, bro. it's always better to lose early anyway. Like, who? that's the the best lost game. Oh, they wasn't ready or, you know, they had to get it together. Woo, woo, woo. You know, fuck that. You lose early, it don't matter. Alabama can lose early and it don't even matter as long as you went out. I mean, like we already know, Alabama can lose twice. Them bitches still getting in there. Right. But, <laughs> you know, but you feel me? I can't wait till this 12 team playoff start. Yeah. In order to real. pass it, they're just trying to figure out when they're going to start it. Oh, yeah, it's going to be real then. It's going to be all the way real then. It's going to be real then. And recruits. And recruits going to be spread out too. Small, the small school is gonna go get them one and that shit. Mm-hmm. For sure. Now that these schools could go to the playoffs like, and shit, like Tulane and all them, they just got to drive that curriculum a little bit, maybe. Mm-hmm. They get two or three of the right niggas, they'll be right in that top twelve. Get the right matchups, end up in the whole fucking national championship. Tulane. So you gotta look at it. Guess what, though? Know what I like in the Georgia-Arkansas game? Two of the top defenses in the country. They put the over and under at 50. I like the over. I like the over in that game. This college football, two-minute possessions. 
You could play. It could be a good defense game and still go over. Like Kyle is two minute possession, fifty and shit. I like it over. So that's they why got, you want that over. Cause yeah, because of, of because of Georgia gonna score on them. Yeah, their defense get but Georgia they getting eighteen. Georgia they gonna have to score to win. Yeah, but nobody's as good scoring as, on them. And they, they, they ain't they ain't played no, they ain't played nobody. I didn't play nobody, man. Texas A&M, dog, almost lost to Texas A&M, not good. They ain't good, brother. Texas A&M. I mean, it was ranked. Not, no, not when they played. Texas A&M, no one ranked no more. I don't think when they yeah, played. Yeah, it was ranked. 20-something? No, I think it was, uh, it was ranked higher than Arkansas. Yeah, it was. What Arkansas rank? Seventeen or something? Arkansas like five. No, now they like five. Well, then it was like fifteen or something. Five? It was they six now or something. Six or seven. Five, six or seven up in there somewhere. Getting eighteen. Eighteen per spread over and under forty. George is like the number one or number two team, huh? George is number two. That Alabama. Alabama number one. Arkansas eight, Georgia two. I mean, it could be like it be like that in college, but you know it just for Arkansas to win it. All right, if this game don't go over, they done beat the fuck out um Arkansas. If this game don't go over, thirty one to seven. Texas A and M scored ten on them. Yeah, it's garbage. DP Georgia Petit. Southern scored 10. Yeah, Georgia Southern run the weed option. Man. Yeah, I mean, you know, Georgia Southern, but Texas scored 21. Texas is kind of good. Texas is kind of good this year. Texas don't got no, like, they style of play, can't play against the SEC. They don't run the ball. They come at five wide receivers every play. And, yeah, Arkansas and, and, and go, Georgia going to hit them in their mouth, brother. Uh. And do that five wide receiver shit. No, they don't do the SEC shit. You know what I'm trying to tell you, dog? The P.P. Vanderbilt, 62 nothing last week. Georgia. You know what I'm trying to tell you? Georgia going to score 30-plus points on anybody this year. I feel that. See what I'm saying? I just think Arkansas got a top defense. They're going to have to prove that shit they do it. And they nice and early. I mean, they got to prove it, dude. Mm-hmm. They ain't play nobody like Arkansas neither yet. No, indeed. They ain't play nobody like they ain't play a D like that this year. Arkansas you know? don't got no D like that, buddy. Man, you crazy? They just they schedule they just play. You about to see y'all Arkansas really garbage, brother. I know, man. Real talk. I've been following this shit though. But Arkansas, I I know they recruit from last year. They got a little better, but they had. They got a little better. Boy. When they got Joe and them, that class, they been up in their way. Joe, Joe's them. a high recruit. And Joe and them doing anything. And they got more niggas after that. And this transfer shit, they got more niggas. That's why they doing better than you would think, Arkansas. The people ain't ranked eight for nothing. They was ranked before this. They were the SEC, bro. Yeah. They about to lose. They was eight for a week. They were eight for eight days. I see. That's a closer game than that. There was not. There was number eight for eight days. I see. That's a close game today. It's over with. I'm actually. I'm but a, the over. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna put a little over something a on Arkansas winning that just to play the money line with that 18. Just on some. I'm gonna say the over just because of that. Georgia gonna score 35, 40 on them. You gonna look up in that game 24 to seven, Georgia, second quarter. <laughs> I'm telling you, brother. Arkansas can't stop a nosebleed when they go to play in the powerhouses and shit, brother. I'm telling you, brother. You know, they smaller. Yeah. Everything. George is just bigger than them. Everything, brother. You going to see, dog. I'm telling you. I like the over, brother. George is going to score close up around that 50 itself. They gonna get with them. They gonna no get way, with them. Fifteen punts to that fifty. Them dudes not doing that. that Jordan them coming like that. Like, so crazy, you're not scoring come. on them dudes like that. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can see them scoring thirty. I love something. you, little joke. Thirty some top. Not this week. And they could beat them. Most likely they could beat them. But I say it's a tough game. <laughs> thirty something. 
early. Yeah, we got some good game in NFL this week. We should have a lot to talk about next week. We got some good games this week. Yeah, dig. Yeah, ain't got nothing. You ain't, you ain't got nothing new to. Oh, I already told y'all. The, uh, oh yeah, once again the upset. Belichick beat Brady. Belichick gonna oh, fucking beat Brady. That's the noodles take, man. Belichick beat that's the, Brady. That's the that's the that's the take that's of the day. Take. I'm sure. That's the take of the fucking thing. Belichick gonna beat Brady. Remember I said it. And we out. We out, man. Smoking sports. Twist.